Hey everybody, welcome back to Control. Hartman's down there, we're gonna have another crack at him. I've called my backup buddy. <laughs> Apologies for what's about to ensue, deployed ranger. <laughs> Let's get to it. Ooh, okay. He is rather peed again. Attack on the side. I could do uh, the side, which side? Right, I'm going to try and stay close to... Whoa, no! <laughs> Mistake! I was going to say, I'm going to try and stay close to this concrete barrier, because uh, the more solid cover we can get, probably the better. Whoa. Uh, wait, hold on. He took a crap ton of damage then, and I, I didn't have any part of it. Hold on. I want to try and get... Ah, oh, damn. I want to see if I can get an explosive charge on him at a time. That seems to... That seems to really damage him. And I... I don't think he's in a rush to actually attack me whilst he's all the way over there. So if my uh, if my backup buddy could just keep him local, that'd be um, much appreciated. Well, no! Okay, yeah, I knew, I knew that tactic was going to fail at some point or other. Wait. Okay. Looks like cover has zero protection against that sort of attack. Wait, no. All right, I thought he was doing the same. Wait, no, no. Naughty. Stop it. Don't you laugh at me. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I think I might have hit back up buddy then. Oh, dear. Wait. Whoa, no. No. Behave. Stop it. Bad Hartman. No. Oh, damn it. Right. It's when he stays still and he's got the big red glow around him. That's when he's launching one of those completely inescapable attacks. So hopefully that particular attack is just a directional thing, I guess. Right. Definitely need my backup buddy here. Send backup to my location. Big help from the backup, bud. Right, you. Be good. Wait, where's he gone? Okay, I thought he was behind me there, but I think it's just another... I think it's another hiss barrier. Damn. Is he... Right, he's... No. Stop it. Whoa. Right. No. Thought he was going to do one of those big attacks again then. It's so, so difficult to tell whether he's just in a mood. Whoa, hello. <laughs> oh, he's doing one of those. At least I managed to avoid that that time. Okay. So it definitely is a directional attack that... That big old, um, this. Whoa! Okay, never mind. Apparently still hurts, even if you're off to the side. Why no? No, thank you. B. A. Whoa, hold on. Okay, apparently we can knock the paddling off of that. Whoa. Dirty. <laughs> right in the ass. Don't know it. Whoa, that's one of the big ones. Is it? No, it's not. Oh, oh, great. Planted that charge and then set it off when it was right next to me. Oh, not ideal. No. Stop it. Oh, Jesus. That was another one. Right, I gained a little bit of health back, I think. My, uh, my backup buddy is doing an outstanding job at the moment. Okay. I think it might be worth me just seeing at some... Oh, God. Backup bud's gone. Can I... I can't get back up there to call another one either. Who? Right. Just me and him now. So he's going to be focusing his attention. No. Whoa. That was too close. He's going to be focusing attention squarely on me. Where's he gone? Oh, no. No, thank you. 
Right, I really need to watch out. Shit. No! Stop it. Behave. Oh. That was lucky. Oh, damn it. <laughs> he did it again. He teleported. Oh, hello. Health. Lovely health. No. No. Ah. Son of a... Hideous beast. No. Right. Oh, crap. <laughs> okay. I'll take a shortcut through uh, through the packing shells. What I'm going to have to do... I'm going to have to start laying a charge on him and then giving it a second. Oh. Before detonating them. In case he... Teleports right next to me like that. Oh man. I think at some point I had some sort of upgrade to. Uh, whoa. No! Behave! Naughty! What? Oh, I got some sort of upgrade at some point to. Um, no! Oh, to energy regen. I'm glad that I did. Because bloody hell does this sap this quickly. Zooming around like this. No! Oh, I thought that was it then. Right. He's getting really, really close. I think these charges are working well. But maybe... Since I've got additional headshot damage. And he's lining his face up next to me so often. Whoa. Like this. It might be worth trying a bit of uh, shooting damage. No. Behave. Don't you show your posterior to me, sir. Wait. Oh, no. Oh, very no. Oh, very much no. Why is... Why can I not... Damn it. No. Right, I'm out of energy as well, which doesn't help. Right. But I can't have... Whoa. Hide help. I will fi find my own. Oh. Oh, my God. Right, I need a second to recover some energy. Oh, my days. Looks like he's working at range again. Has he got some sort of overshield? Is that what I'm seeing? Weirdly, he doesn't look like he's in a huge hurry to come and uh, come and get me. Right, I have noticed. What? No! Stop it! Behave! Oh my word! Yeah, this light is here, which is kind of handy. Where is he? I can't even see him. I can't see him, and I hate that. He's over there somewhere. Oh, there he is. Why? Right, I'm missing something here, because that shield is not going down. Can I now retarget these power cells? Yes, I can. Oh, dirty. Okay. So I guess I've just got to plug these things back in. He's there, though. Stay there. Oh, I'm not going to like this. No. Oh, right. What now? Where is he? There he is. No. Settle. Oh my god, that was too close. No. <laughs> Hartman was indeed stretched. Whoa. Oh, brilliant. Here we go again. 
Oh, great. Goody gumdrops. No, sick. Oh. Hartman seems to leave me alone. Whoa. No. Damn it. No. I'm not going to be off by a foot soldier. Oh, my days. Too close. Too damned close. Right. Oh, my God. Far. Far too close for my liking. You stay there. Okay. No. Be good. <laughs> Where's the cell? There's the cell. Right, room's back on. Oh my word, this is horrendous. Hartman, please die. No. No, don't devour by hungry darkness. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, good God. No, I'm out of energy. Oh no, I can't even dash. I can't even dash. I hate this. Oh, right, you. Please work for me. No, it's out of range. Crap. Right, another thing I've noticed. I don't think we can damage Hartman whilst the lights are off. He seems to just pull all of his strength from the darkness itself. What's that? That's an audio recording. We don't need that yet. Right. I'm going to swoop over there, see if I can't pick up some of that health. Okay. Good. Oh. Would you, like, go away, please? <laughs> it's not too much trouble. Alright, let's get over here and pick up this. Slap it in there. Descend into the light. Go away. Don't dance at me. I, I mean, I don't, I don't mind what you do. You can metamorphosize all you like, but please don't be so close to me. You're making me somewhat uh, self-conscious. Okay. Whoa. Wait, whoa. Okay, that was confusing. He's in a mood, isn't he? Uh-oh. No. No. Will you stop with the... Stop it! Oh. That's really annoying. Am I missing a beat? Am I supposed to be doing a thing? Right, let's see if we can't recruit a friend. Oh, God! I just got hit by Hartman. Right, so great. He's now attacking even when I'm in the light. That's not great. At least we're getting a reasonably decent source of um, health pickups. Whoa. No, stop it. Oh, okay, back up here again. No! Stop! Behave. Holy crap. Yeah, the bar, at the, the bar at the bottom does not even twitch. And he's right between me and the next bloody cell. Urgh. Don't like this. I don't particularly want to hover right over his head in order to pick up that next cell. But I don't know if I've got an awful lot of choice. Screw it. Let's go for it. Okay. Just die, please. Whoa. No, not the big bum blast again. There we go. Where is he? So, he's doing it again. Oh, he's doing it again, wiping out the bloody lights. What's going on? Am I missing something? Am I supposed to be doing something else to kill him faster when the lights are still on? Because if so, I don't know what it is. Right, you. No. Uh oh. Problem. Oh no, I might be in trouble here. Oh my god. 
Right, please, give me a clue. What am I doing wrong? Just... No! 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 Stop it! Stop! Oh. Is it something to do with when he raises his fist? No, it's not. Oh my god. What's going on? Right. What's wrong? What's happening? I don't understand. I feel like I'm I'm going about this entire process all wrong. But I can't work out how I can do anything any differently. Right, there's oh it's not a splody boy. Wait, are you a heavy? Oh no, we don't like you. Oh, you can sit down. Go away, personnel, not interested. Right, let's see. Right, what am I missing? Somebody tell me what I'm missing, I don't understand. Okay. Where is he? I feel like he's... Yeah, he's over in that corner. Okay. Is it literally that I'm just not doing enough damage? What? Oh. <laughs> oh, unreal. I feel like I should have killed that guy like five times over. What am I missing? What's... What's the key to this encounter that I'm not picking up on? Maybe that's a cue. Have we got to maybe go back up to that control room? No. <laughs> no, because it hits barriers as soon as we arrive. Right. Let's try this again. I'm going to try and get back to the same... The same stage. What? No. Behave. Sit. Yeah, I'm going to try and get back to the same state again. Whoa. No. And when he knocks the lights out. What? Dirty. Stop it. Naughty. When he knocks the lights out next time, I'll go back up to that main camp. What? No, you don't. What? No. Behave. Oh, it's my... Oh, no, never mind. I was about to say, is my buddy for hire been wiped out already? But it sounds like he's okay. No. Oh, crap. What did I hit there? I was... It's like I ran straight into something. Wow. You fell. There you go. A few shots to the bot. Right. So, let's try out this little tactic. Into the light. Full health. Let's dispatch your buddies. You. No. Right. Here, have a power core. You could be my new friend. Oh god, I just knocked him down. Sorry. <laughs> oh, right. Well, that's the end of him. Um, that one's on. This one's on. So I'm guessing... Okay. Our buddy for hire is still up. Okay, let's see. Is there something that I need to activate up here? Has something been turned on? Is there a switch? There's a dossier. Oh my god. No, there's nothing there. Crap. Is there something? No, there's nothing here. Can we get up? We can't get up to the office. What the hell? What am I missing? Sit. 
Downward. Naughty. Right, I'm trying to recruit this guy, but it's not it's not going very well. Okay. Great past you. Over to the light. Ooh. Got to be something that I'm not seeing. Have I got to maybe lure him somewhere? Not that I can really see what what good that would do. No. Wait, I'm... Yeah, it's darkness again. <sighs> this is infuriating. You lot, what am I missing? <laughs> What's not complete in this picture? Oh, my days. Let's get the lights back on. I wonder if there's anything... I had said I wonder if he was going to go into um, into the building here. Let's see if we can bust the door down on that thing or anything. And see if there's a clue. That's all I want is a clue. Right, so now he gets angry again. No. That doesn't look right to me. So can we... Can we activate this train carriage? Is it anything to do with that? No? This looks like it's Hartman's cell. Oh, God, here we go again. There's got to be something so obvious that I'm missing. And I can imagine that you guys are probably screaming at the screen at the moment. These cables lead to that platform, but we've already we've already served a purpose on that platform, haven't we? What is it I'm missing? I'm <laughs> I'm so utterly baffled. Let's shoot out a skylight. Oh man, this is getting ridiculous. Hmm. What am I missing? Right, before I go <laughs> throw myself into the grinder again, um, just up in the control room here, there are a couple of bits about Bright Falls by the looks of it. Um, there's a picture... <laughs> yes! There's a picture of what I assume to be... Oh, okay. Yeah, that is definitely what this mock-up mansion is. That particular home there. What have we got? In Tenebras Cardery, I think. Doesn't seem to be a clue. I think this is just, you know, Bright Falls, Best Cupcakes, Bright Diner. This is all just general information about Bright Falls by the looks of it. Um, doesn't appear to be a clue as to how to take him down. Oh, there is a document on the ground here. Let's take a look at this. Alice Wake interview. Oh, interesting. So Alice... Alice came in, didn't she? Compiled by Derek Shah and Caroline Dempsey, special agents, uh, by order of William Kirkland. After reaching out to the Bureau, Alice Wake was brought into the oldest house for an interview on Redacted 2017, so two years ago. See file Redacted for full transcript. The interview conducted by agents Shah and Dempsey revealed that Mrs. Wake had been recurring, uh, had had recurring nightly visitations from her mis missing ex-husband, in her New York apartment, address redacted. Mr. Wake appears out of nowhere and rushes at her down the corridor. According to her impression, he appears crazy and horrifying, clearly coming at her with violent intent. Has he maybe been taken by the darkness or by the hiss in these visions? Um, Mrs. Wake believes he is haunting her, insisting he is not Alan, but a fucking monster in his body. Now, Alan Wake in the uh, Ocean View was talking to... Um, oh, what was his name now? Tom, Thomas Zane, the director, come actor, come poem, 
writer, but also they spoke about a double. Could this be the double? Mrs. Wake has not been sleeping out of fear of these visits. Her attempts to keep the lights on throughout the night resulted in the relevant hallway's light bulb breaking every night, possibly in indicating involvement of the redacted. Further investigation required. We propose installing monitoring equipment in the apartment. Copies of supply request form blah have been sent to Mr. Kirkland's administration for approval. Nothing there to help us with our little problem. Oh my... I'm... I'm absolutely fresh out of ideas. So the thing that I don't get is... Okay, we hurt him to an extent. We whittled down his actual health bar. He then thumps the ground, knocks the lights out because he shakes the uh, the power cores out of the generators. <sighs> and then we slot them back in. We can't do any damage to him when the lights are off. We slot them back in and then he, he just thumps them out again before we can do any real damage. Is it because... Am I, am I just sucking too hard? Is that what it is? Is it that... I just need to kill him quicker? That can't be it, surely. After coming all this way and defeating him relatively easily in the other locations, there must be something more to it. I need a ranger at this location immediately. Let's put him down! All right, guys. I hang my head partially in shame. I've, <laughs> I've had to consult the interwebs, namely the great oracle in the sky, Reddit, and uh, found out that um, there is a technique that we can try out where we can hopefully stop him from actually turning the lights off. So we'll see if this rings true. But for now, we've got to um, go through the old routine of whittling him down. No. Okay, that was the... Uh... No! <laughs> no, you don't. Uh-oh. Okay. Enough of the red... Uh oh No. Stop it. That's it. Show me that lovely smile of yours. You target those goofy teeth. Part, with all the practice that we've had, feels like it's it's getting steadily. I'm not going to say easier because that's just asking for trouble, but um, less troublesome, I guess. Whoa, that additional headshot damage we do with uh, with grip definitely helps matters. No. Right. Oh, no, he, he apparently does not. <laughs> he didn't even bother trying to shoot, shoot the charge off by the looks of it. Oh, oh you dirty dog. Right, he's nearly... Oh, no, stop it. Behave. He's nearly there. Oh, he is there. Right. Now, I have heard <laughs> a little rumour... Oh, okay, let's stay in the light for now. Oh, regroup. Right, our guy needs a hand by the looks of it. Let's get him a pal to play with. Is our boy... Okay, I don't know if our guy is actually still alive. He may very well not be alive anymore. Oh, no, he is. He's over there. Excellent. Hardy fellow. All right, let's go and plug a few of these things back in. Regain some of our strength. Next. You. Okay. Now, I read on to interwebs that apparently... Whoa. Right. Oh. No, you don't. Apparently, launching stuff at him when he does this... No, wait, that didn't work. Oh, it did. Nice. Oh, fantastic. We can stop him. We can stop him from killing the lights. What? No. Oh, God. He's right there. Uh, 
I thought I fought rock. Oh. Oh, interesting. Hold on. We stopped him from turning the lights off just by, um... Wow. By shooting at him. Interesting. Looks like our uh, gun for hire is still there. He's dead. Unreal. Hartman won't be a problem anymore, Langston. <laughs> but investigations need someone to run it. Ooh. Interested? I've seen what happens to sector heads, ma'am. No, thank you. Ma'am, I'm getting something on my terminal here, an AWE alert from Bright Falls, Washington. But uh -oh. it might be a glitch. The date's all wrong a couple of years in the future. And we're in lockdown. There shouldn't be any incoming signals. Maybe it was active before we went into lockdown? Are there agents on site? <laughs> Let me check. Agent Estevez is the field agent in charge of monitoring the site, so she should be there to let us know if the situation has been through any major changes recently. The spiral door. <laughs> you have been warned. <laughs> I'm in in again. You survived. Oh, right, marvelous. Um, do me a favor. Could you just send me a um, send me a post-it through the pneumatic? Would you stand still? Send me a post-it through the pneumatic tube system with your name and rank. I'll ensure you get a three hundred percent pay rise. You're most efficient. Um, dismissed. You can stop following me now. <laughs> kind of creepy. <laughs> Don't put that pay rise in jeopardy. Oh my word! That was that was solid. So. It I, I'm not sure what I was doing wrong. Was I... Was I stopping firing on Hartman too early? Not interested. Um, was I, like, just leaving off whenever he was raising his fist to to thump down and shake the power cores out? Or or did I need to throw something at him initially to actually um, shake him up a little bit? Oh, well. <laughs> at least he's over and done with. Right. AWE 10. Event date 1976, Bright Falls, Washington. Oh, hold on. An unconfirmed threshold manifestation occurred at Cauldron Lake, Washington. The citizens of Bright Falls had gathered in the town's southwestern fields for the annual festival known as Deerfest. Eyewitnesses all claim that the day had been sunny, confirmed by reviews of the area's weather reports, but then with no warning a thunderstorm appeared in the direction of the Anderson Farm and a tornado ra rose from Cauldron Lake. The torrential rain that followed caused a flash flood. It was as if the day had turned to night, testimony from Redacted. Frank Breaker, the sheriff of Bright Falls, formerly a bureau agent, see employee file Redacted, managed to guide the crowd to safety as the festival grounds were destroyed by the flood. The festival was cancelled, ending one day early. Lack of official bureau presence on the scene makes this event difficult to report as a confirmed AWE, though the similarity to other known events in Bright the Bright Falls area lend credence to the accounts of the townspeople. And this was back in the 70s? Bloody hell, okay. So it looks like Cauldron Lake is definitely the centre of um, a hell of a lot of curious activity. Ow. Much ow. Collect. So, yeah, I wanted to take a look over here. This, this must be where they studied Hartman. I was about to say, this must be where he was contained. Kind of looks like Dylan's cell. Yeah. I wonder if they treated him as badly. Well, seeing as this cell is um, <laughs> several times smaller than Dylan's. I'd say it's probably a pretty good chance. So he was stuck in here when the Hiss Resonance just passed on through? He didn't stand a chance, did he? Bloody hell. Bright Falls 1976 Supplement. So, supplement to that flash flood. On the day of the flooding, the rock band Old Gods of Asgard was rehearsing in a field outside the Anderson Farm, the homestead of band members... Uh, yeah, band members Odin and Tor Anderson. Oh, that's where they come from. 
they've been mentioned a few times, haven't they, in reports? Both admitted to having been in a, a heavy state of inebriation at the time, having spent days drinking their home-brewed moonshine while celebrating Deerfest. <laughs> Fair enough. After the townspeople were evacuated from the flooded field, Sheriff Breaker was asked by Freya Anderson, daughter of Tor Anderson, to check on her father and uncle. Breaker drove to the Anderson farm and found the band members alive but in need of medical aid. Tor Anderson had been struck by lightning, and Odin Anderson had cut his own right cut out his own right eye. A possible reference to Norse deities redacted and redacted. They claimed they had fought and valiantly defeated a dark army of the scratching hag rising from Colgen Lake. E. W. E. Redacted, nineteen seventy, related to suspected blah 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 of Divers Isle. While it's impossible to verify, these events are relevant to the recurring AWE at Bright Falls and the Cauldron Lake redacted. Odin and Tor Anderson have been listed as persons of interest. Well, we know that they were picked up during the more recent activity at Cauldron Lake. Are you okay? This range is really starting to uh, irritate me now. I think there was a... Really? I just cleared this place out! <laughs> Why? Why are you like this? Damn it. Okay, hold on. No, I'm not going to be defeated by bloody hiss after I've just taken out Hartman. Crap. We found another couple of files by the looks of it. No. Oh, my... Really? <laughs> right, let's go and call my buddy for hire here. This is the director. I need a ranger at this location it's immediately. Order, director. And let's clear this place out. So I'm going to go ahead and swap Surge out for Pierce because that seemed to be pretty effective against uh, the Hiss Clusters. I think maybe it might be worth me making a beeline for there as well so I at least get sort of the uh, the height advantage. Right, this should be a cakewalk compared to what we've just taken down. Looks can be what? Looks can be deceiving though. Right, where's it moving to now? Yes, that'll do. Damn! Bloody thing evaded me! Right, that's you done. Right, let's take out... Hold on, have I got any floating? No, I haven't. Take... What? Oh, well, that didn't work, did it? Sit down. Right, you be handy on my side, please. Oh, crap. Why? There we go. Right, if you wouldn't mind getting out of my face. Okay. Whoa. Right, where's our big fella? Here he is. Two shots to the head, please. No. Put it down. Put it down. Oh, great. Yeah, I didn't mean put it down in my face. Oh, balls. Right, let's uh, let's wait for him to expend all of his uh, his throwables once more. Wait, is he expending? He's not expending. Oh, great, more! I just want to go and pick up some documents. That's all. Right, at least my buddy for hire is uh, is doing a damn good job actually of uh, distracting them all. Tell you what, they're bloody annoying. I think I took that one down. Oh, oh, 
are you serious? This is worse than... Oh. <laughs> I thought I had a hard time with Har Hartman. Let's go grab some health. I'm feeling a little bit exposed at the moment. No. Not interested. Go away. Crap. Where's the other one? Where's the other one? Right, no more, please. Oh, you've... Oh, great, it's one of these. Right, come on, then. Come on, then. Get in nice and close. You chicken. There it is. Here it comes. Come on, how about you? At least I've got lots of tasty health around here. Right, I still don't feel we've got enough time to, uh, to get charge up and running. Here it is. Come on in. Whoa, that was a little bit too in your face for, uh, for my liking. Yes, I see you there. I see you. Come on. Right, a couple more of those, and I think we might have it. Oh, it's gone all shy, look. Here it is. Yes, I hear you. Please let that be it. Good God. All this for a few documents I want to look at. <laughs> so, should we get... I, I'm amazed at this guy still breathing. Should we get back to it? Where did I see the other one? I think I already grabbed a document from up here. Yes, I did. There were a couple in this little um, makeshift office area, I think, wasn't there? Yeah, here we go. What do we got? Wake photograph. Oh my god. <laughs> I was not expecting that. <laughs> Evidence ID blah. Photograph of Alan Wake provided by Alice Wake taken on Redacted. Oh, interesting. That's appeared a few times in those visions, hasn't it? So she actually genuinely did see him and photograph him in the apartment? Wake evidence. A photograph of Alan Wake captured by Alice Wake during an event in her home. Alice Wake, former wife of Alan Wake, see AWE35 for details, has recently been visited at night by her ex-husband or entity resembling him, see file redacted for more. Being a professional photographer, Mrs. Wake positioned cameras with motion sensors around the corridor he appears in and managed to capture an image of Mr. Wake on film. During an interview with Mrs. Wake, she mentioned that her favourite camera, a redacted model, was lost in 2010 during AWE35. No match has been found among the confiscated evidence from AWE35. It has been filed as a potential altered item and research staff stationed at Bright Falls are being contacted to check if they have any knowledge of such an item. So again, that might not even be Alan. That could be this double that was mentioned. Right, finally. <laughs> we finally picked it up. The audio recording. These are the notes of Dr. Emil Hartman. I am continuing my work alone again since certain parties were too blind to recognize a golden opportunity. Despite my generous offers, the conversations came to naught. Some people simply do not value collaboration as I do. Though I believe now that it was for the best. The sort of bold, pioneering work that I am undertaking cannot thrive under the shackles of bureaucracy and regulation. I have a history of seeking such partnerships. 
There was a time when I hoped Alan Wake and I could collaborate. Hmm. Together we could have produced art such that the world has never seen. But Wake was stubborn, egotistical. Writers usually are. Disappointing nonetheless. But now, like Tom before him, Wake Ooh. has disappeared into Cauldron Lake. And this is where my work turns. Hypothetical. Since he was lost to the lake, Thomas Zane has been observed by various townspeople. This indicates to me that the individuals within the lake are not entirely gone. I anticipate Wake will similarly return one day. While I may harbor some resentment for the man, his raw talent and determination are undeniable. From this, I have concluded that the lake and the dark place within it are not as removed from this world as I previously thought. Given my acute awareness of what awaits within, my meticulous preparations, and my considerable education, <laughs> I believe myself much more prepared than either Tom or Wake. I should be able to cross into that dark realm with the chance to return as they oh. All that remains is the dive itself. It frightens me, I admit, but such is the burden of the truth seeker. I will take my plunge into the dark tomorrow with only the light of knowledge to guide me. It is time for a breakthrough. Until I return. Good God. So he was pushed to the absolute limit, wasn't he? Everything... Are you still following me? <laughs> Everything had been taken away from him by the Bureau. And he had absolutely nothing left. And he'd seen Tom Zane go into the lake and return. Alan Wake go into the lake and apparently return. No thanks, you can stay there. And decided that he had nothing else left to lose. So he might as well go ahead and do the same thing himself. Absolute lunacy. Right, we finally beat Hartman. Good God. And, uh, oh, interesting point that um, Langston was offered the position of um, of set to head for investigations. Oh, look who's following. And uh, turned it down. I know what happens to sector heads. Yeah, probably the wisest decision you've ever made, Langston. Guys, next time we are going to go around and clean up the last couple of little bits that we have to do for Artie. Uh, I think we still have one patch of darkness to clear up i believe and we've got to go and find the source of those chain letters and then i think that's investigations complete i'm gonna head back whoa <laughs> head back through this crushed door just to see if langston has anything to say about the situation i'd be surprised if he doesn't oh uh no <laughs> apparently not you do surprise me langston but uh, until then Thank you very much for watching. If you'd like to leave a like or you care to leave a comment, you know exactly what to do. And uh, yeah, we're going to be getting back on track, back to the Bureau proper. And uh, I think it's about time that we tied up a couple of loose knots, seeing as we uh, we felled one boss. Let's go and face another. I'll catch you in the next one. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.